secrets. Highest tier French cruiser. Um, Henry. Wait, what the fuck? This is not the Henry. Uh, Henry. Tallinn. Oh fuck, no. Uh, Dodge. Damn it. That pile of garbage. I never want to play that thing anymore. Henry. Let's play Henry. Do I still have IFHE on my Henry uh, Captain? I never play Henry, so I might. No, I don't. Ooh, this. Uh, I mean, this is not perfect setup, but there is there is no perfect setup for Henry. It is just a shit ship, in my opinion. I mean, not shit, but eh, pretty mess ship. But I need a uh, speed boost upgrade from the armory, so let's go shopping. Uh, you garbage. Oh, fuck you, uh, Dodge. Tallinn is a pile of trash. Just as... I don't know. Just as Kansas. Just to put a same tier ship. Uh, engine boost. That, this is what we need. I know a ship. Legendary Suffering Drake. Yeah, as well. I mean, the whole uh, UK Heavy Cruiser line was... A complete waste of time for wargaming. I mean, nobody really plays those ships uh, that I know of, at least. So, yeah. Oh, instant match. Okay. Are you ready to see some slow, um, long range HE spam game? This is what you are about to see, guys. Aren't you excited? Oh, we're giving pay to lose. Okay. Uh, in Petropavlovsk and Z52. Hmm. Again, no carriers. Am I blessed by the matchmaking today? I think I am, for some reasons. Rare Navy Heavy Cruisers line was just a bluff to IGN Cruisers. A buff, sorry, to, I, to IGN Cruisers. Uh, what? In which sense exactly? How are they? How are, are they even related, Dodge? Can you explain? I mean, introducing a line that is even worse than uh, the IGN cruisers. I, th I mean, in this sense, it is kind of a buff. I, I can see your point, but yeah, but under creeping instead of power creeping, yeah, um, I, I I got your point, but yeah. <laughs> um... Is this really w what it takes to actually uh, buff again IGN cruisers? Is that what you uh, well, what it really takes to uh, make them decent uh, again? Wow. Yeah, I'm so sad about this the current state of Zhao, for example, at tier ten. Z what the fuck are you doing, in your potato Holland? Uh, you are spawned here, and what he does, he goes here, then he realizes that this is a dumb move, and what he does, he, he goes back to here. What the fuck, Haaland? What are you doing? What is wrong with you? So in comparison, it makes IGM better, yeah. We have a Bleak and a Conqueror here, so they are never gonna push anything. Unless they want to die really, really, really soon. I see some similarity to both German BBs, USN. New was introduced. Yeah. Oh. Survivability expert Yamato. Plus one. Plus one. In immediately. It's good to be back, guys. My aim is rusty, but the potatoes are not. Potatoes are still here. I'm so glad to see that some things ne never change in this game. I mean, it is good to have some, I mean, some things to actually to, to rely on, I mean, to, to be sure about. And one thing that, that, that you're, you're gonna be sure is that potatoes are gonna potate. Hello. How was the acceleration before Nerf Hammer? It was very good actually. And 
you could literally juke uh, plenty of incoming fire in Henry. Nowadays it is less retarded, which is a good thing in my opinion. So I don't think that Henry is like... Um, Henry was so frustrating to deal with, so frustrating to deal with uh, at, at that point. So it was actually a good nerf in my opinion, a, a nerf that was needed. Because you... So Ravity Expert curse first. Okay, this is almost as retarded as Sorovite Expert Yamato. Maybe even more. Give the Royal Navy Heavies the Smolensk reload time and I'll be content. Yeah, I mean, there is no point for those cruisers to have such a huge reload. Uh, I don't know. Compared to Petro, Henry is a joy to deal with, even before nerf. Uh, I mean, yes and no. Yes and no. I shouldn't really go where I'm going. What the fuck is th are these guys doing all in this vertical line like this? What? What, what, what am I watching here? And what are these guys doing? Uh, what? This guy whiffed all his torpedoes from like 2 kilometers on a Shimakaze. Well, well done. Okay. Uh, are you not gonna take those torpedoes, right? Okay, he's fine. Is he? Yeah. Is this guy fine? I mean, dealing with, against Petro, I mean, if you angle towards Petropavlovsk, you're good-ish. You might not mm, deal too much damage to him in return, yes. But, ooh. But, um, yeah, you shouldn't be that, shouldn't be that huge of a problem. Shit, I wasted a reload booster for nothing. My potato. Yep. AP, huh? Nice. And now we do what we do best, which is kiting. Do French uh, see a have the French turtleback? Uh, no. Uh, actually, fr French ships don't have any turtleback. They do have spaced armor, uh, though. So this means that you have... Um, I mean... If you don't aim for this area under the turrets, you can get away without citadels pretty, pretty easily. And for example, Henry eats a fuck ton of overprints from Yamato, for example, at medium to close range, which is pretty retarded, in my opinion. So this is one of the other reasons why Henry was very frustrating to deal with. Um, but yeah. Look at this guy playing here with his Yamato. Oh, come on, Thunder, where are you? There you are. Why is he going for that spot? He's gonna be there. I mean, he has to turn, right? Stop, Henry, guys. Stop. God damn it. Can we actually YOLO this guy? I'm pretty sure I can even signal this guy from mid from very close range. So let's load AP. And let's try to do something stupid, which is YOLO in this thunder. So don't try this at home. This is absolutely not recommended. Also because this guy has some support. Those two camping... BBs like the Curve First and the um, and the Yamato. But you know, we are here to have some fun, so 
Let's go. Engine boost activated. This guy fired HE, right? Okay. Hello. Hi. Wow, nice dispersion there, Thunder guy. Oof. Goodbye. That wasn't wasn't bad, I have to say. Can we get away with that? Mm. No fucking Petro Pavlos, I hate you. Luckily for us he underestimated our speed. 9k for you, enjoy! Git good Petro Pavlos guy Oh, probably the expert Yamato shot me He's gonna be Citadel for sure yeah, almost. Fuck you, Yamato guy. Four non pens, huh? Top, 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 top. Ow. Like it, let's use this field booster. And there is no way I'm gonna set this guy on fire, right? Oh, look at that, a fire. Am I dead now? I might. Nice. Takes a long range HE spammer, drives by a BB, yeah, but you know, uh, this is not what you should do in a um, in a Henry, I mean on average. So don't do this, I mean, that thunder was a pretty potato, honestly, so you shouldn't really do what I did, but it was, it was fucking fun, I, I, I have to, I, I have to admit that. It was actually fun. Can I go and detect behind this island before he shoots me? Of course not. This is a perma for you though. So thank you and your Yamato with Surovity Expert. Just saying. He should be dead. Nice. Awesome, and we won with the Henry a ship that I don't, I, that I never play, that I don't really, that I don't particularly like. Let's try to farm even more damage because why not? No, he repaired the fire, goddammit. 160, okay. 
And they're left with the survivability expert Kerfus that is still full HP roaming around in this spawn. How unusual, guys. How unusual. Survivability expert is playing as dumb as they can. I mean that was a one shot basically on the on the thunder seven citadels. I didn't I didn't think I could just one shot him with one volley. This is why I was I popped my real booster earlier than actually shooting. But yeah, that was a pretty decent moment I would say. So now just to make sure that this Kerfus and this Yamato deserved my initial re report, just to make sure of, of that that I don't didn't waste a report on a non-potato.